Hi there, Jeffrey Rhodes from Experimental Homesteader, Exotic Gardening, and Cherry and Richardson.com. Oh, this one's very late. Um, <laughs> came home, uh, had a, a good day at work, really. Um, got my eight hours. Um, had between the regular shelves and the, the mill cut stuff, I had about 400 shelves today. Um, still not up to the point where, uh, I have been in the past and where it probably will be going, um, because I'm not yet getting 400 regular shelves plus the mill cut. Um, I had like just under 300 of the regular shelves and then a hundred and something of, of the uh, mill cut. So... But I know that's going to go up. Um, I know I'm going to be getting probably four or five hundred of the regular, plus then you know about a hundred of, of the mill cut, and that'll probably be my average. So figure, you know, five six hundred shelves a day. Uh, but uh, they haven't yet gotten the fourth assembly line running yet. Um, I did see that I've got a four, a cell four, uh, batch of shelves, um, for Tuesday, but it was just a small, like one truck. Um, you know, I think I have maybe 10 shelves for, for one truck for cell four on Tuesday. So it's not much. But uh, every little bit that they do on cell four uh, leads to, you know, <laughs> them actually getting it ready and uh, seeing a lot more. Um, and uh, at the moment, I can still handle, you know, like I said, I, I think I can. We can probably manage like 350 shelves on my two carts of regular shelves, plus then the cart of the milk cut and I don't do those until after I've cleared everything off of the other two carts so I can move one of those carts out of the way and bring in my milk cut stuff so it works out pretty well and I can I can run you know about 400 shelves uh, you know four or 450 uh, in that way but um, I know once they start getting to the point that they're actually bringing me pallets, that there's going to be a problem. Um, and we'll see if they actually come up with a solution for that before I'm actually swamped with, you know, 400 regular shelves on pallet, or, you know, 100 shelves on pallets and then 300 on the carts and, you know, nowhere to put that actual pallet uh, without me being out in the I always. So, I don't know. I don't have a solution yet. And I'm not sure whether they're going to have a solution for me before it happens. It may take them actually showing up with a pallet and my two carts for them to finally see what I'm actually talking about. Um, but uh, it wasn't too bad of a day. Um, had to stop, um, actually made a stop before coming home and, uh, got Sherry two more, uh, raggedies, a raggedy Ann and a raggedy Andy. Um, someone in, in Gas City was selling them. They are, um, older. Um, we're not quite sure where in the, the, the lineup they kind of fall. Um, they are, I believe, knickerbockers. So they're early. Um, <laughs> they're earlier, but they're not necessarily real old. Um, so they're, they're in that, that area that she likes to get. Um, they were a little dirty, but 
not too bad, and we can probably clean them up a little bit. So they're good additions to what Sherry has. Um, and this was her Valentine's Day gift, uh, at least in part. Um, and uh, so I picked those up. Uh, had to go to Meyer and pick up a few things uh, before coming home. Uh, then we wound up going back out to Meyer. <laughs> um, then we also went to uh, Culver's and had some ice cream and, uh, before we came home. So, uh, but, uh, anyways, um, I think that's going to do it tonight. It's late. I need to get to sleep. Um, so, uh, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up, thumbs down, comments below, and we will see everybody tomorrow. Stay safe out there.